Hi, in this video we're going to show you the Microsoft Edge Ask Copilot feature. So Copilot is Microsoft's AI interface, kind of like a chat GPT type of thing. And if you're using Windows 11, maybe even Windows 10, we'll actually have it down here too. You'll have a little uh, Copilot icon here, which you could disable if you want to go to the taskbar settings. And then if you're an Edge user, you'll have it up here as well, where you could click on it and you know ask questions and that type of thing, kind of like chat GPT does. So we actually did a video on the Copilot feature. So now they have an Ask Copilot feature for uh, Microsoft Edge, and they also have it coming up for Notepad as well, where you could have it analyze your Notepad files. So to use it, um, all you need to do is right-click on some text and run it. But before we do that, let's just kind of go over this web page we're going to demo it on. So this page talks about how to rip music CDs with the Windows 11 media players. So let's kind of go through and see what's on this page real quick here. A little introduction. How to load your CD and see the songs. How to go to the different settings here. How to change your RIP settings, change your format. How to edit the album info. Where your music files are going to be stored after it's ripped. And how to run it. And then how to check the properties of your files. All right, so let's, let's just highlight this first paragraph here. Right click on it, ask Copilot. So it'll kind of load the text that you've added here. And then we'll go online and find some information about it. Okay, so you can see it gave you a summary here. So it took the content from this entire page, even though we just highlighted the uh, first paragraph and kind of added its own information here. Tells you about the file types, formatting. But it actually got the information by going online to find related information. So what we could do here is click on answer from this page instead. So what that'll do is it'll actually take the information from the web page itself, not what it finds online related to it. Okay, but you can see it only took it from the first paragraph, so let's try it again here and highlight everything on the page. You know, it's not going to analyze the pictures, of course, but it's just you know, going to highlight everything here. And let's start over again. So right now it's going online and it's going to find the same information it did before. It even found some outdated information about MP3s because MP3s are an option now. Okay, so now let's try answering from this page instead. See, it's going over the settings as well. Editing the info of the file like we talked about. Okay, so there's a summary of the page here. You know, sort of detailed, but it could probably use a little more information, just kind of a breakdown. And then, of course, you have the answer from the web uh, option again, and then some additional queries here. And it tells you the reference here from the actual website itself. And if we go back to the other ones, it tells us the reference there as well. And for the first one here, it has some additional information. So if we go to this PC mag, so this one here is what it found online based on the text we highlighted. But if we click on this, it'll take you to the source of where it got its information. So it's a similar article. And you can try this as well. Kind of related information. And then some other options here. And you have options here to like or dislike, copy the information, export it, read it aloud, and so on. And then, of course, at the bottom, too, it'll give you some other suggestions based on, you know, topics that found in the page here, like some other ways to convert CDs into digital files. 
And I'll just run another analysis here and give you some more information, probably with some extra links at the bottom of that when it's finished as well. Okay, so that's the uh, basic overview of the Ask Copilot feature in Microsoft Edge. It's not going to work with images. If you right-click on an image, it doesn't tell you anything. You could do the visual search if you want to find something related, but it's not going to uh, actually look for information and put it into the uh, Copilot feature itself. All right, so once again, just highlight the text you want, right-click on it, Ask Copilot, and then it'll give you information based on what it finds online, and you have the option to get the information from the page itself, but you should probably highlight all of the information on that web page itself if you want to use that feature to make sure it gives you everything based on that page. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.